Hello, I'm Lucia. 你好，我是 Lucia. Today, I will teach you different ways to say no in English and Chinese. Let's get started. Let's start with the basic one. When it's about a permission, you say no, you cannot do that. Or when it sounds more strong, it's like no way, no way. In Chinese, it's 不行，不行，不可以，不可以，不行，不可以。Number two, a knowledge or an opinion is not right. In English, we say no, it's not right. It's not possible. No, it's not right. It's not possible. In Chinese, we will say, 不是的，不是的，不对，不对。It's not possible. 不可能，不可能，不是的，不对，不可能。It's not right. It's not possible. Number three is about the invitation and the promotions that you can refuse it directly. For example, in the store, people ask you, "Do you need any help?" Or in a restaurant, they ask you, "Do you need another drink? Do you need a cup of water?" In English, we can say, "I'm good, thanks. I'm good, thanks." In Chinese, we say, 不用了，谢谢。不用了 that means no need. 不用了，谢谢。Or 不需要了，谢谢。I don't need it. 不需要了 Let's also talk about some scenarios that you cannot refuse them directly. Yeah, let's talk about some tactful ways. The first one is to express the feeling of um, I don't really like it. Let's say someone asks your opinion about a restaurant. You can say it's just okay. It's uh just so so. That already has a negative meaning. In Chinese, we say 一般般一般般 for just so so, just okay, 一般般 Maybe you can also give them some more recommendations so they can enjoy their food more. Number two is kind of、uh, specific in China. <laughs> It is a theoretically correct, but theoretically yes, but that's 理论上可以，但是不可以。<laughs> 理论上可以 ，theoretically correct, but and there is a joke in China that says when people tell you 理论上可以 that means a no, and 理论上不可以 That means a yes. Number three is to refuse the invitations more softly and more tactfully. You can show your positive attitudes first, like, "Oh, I like that restaurant. That sounds great. I would like to, but I have some other plans already settled. But I have some work to do." In Chinese, also, you show your positivity. 我也很想去，但是，呀，我很喜欢这家餐馆。我也很想去。只是我已经有其他的安排了，只是我有工作要做。And you can also say, "Enjoy your lunch, enjoy your journey." 你们好好吃，你们好好吃。That's not the exact translate, but we usually say that. You can also say, "I will join next time. I will join next time." 下次我和你们一起去。下次我和你们一起去。Well, personally, I like to make things more straightforwardly. Well, if it's something, make the interaction softer and smoother. Why not? Hope you enjoy today's lesson, and I will see you soon.